Hello, and today I'm here reviewing Wings of Fire Winter Turning. And this is the newest book. It just came out on June 30th. And oddly enough, the next one is set to come out on Janu in January. So it's not that far till the next one. But I have to say, I'm actually having problems sinking into this new book that I want to read because I got so caught up in this world and I want to know what happens next so badly that I can't focus. I just want more dragon books. This this writer is just absolutely fabulous. This The world building is amazing. In the first couple books I was kind of confused because I didn't actually realize like what role humans were going to play. And as the series has went on, like, we've kind of seen some of them um, try to challenge dragons. And we have seen a couple who are actually pets of dragons. So it's really interesting. Dragons are the dominant species on the planet. And there are several different types of dragons. And I love them. And this one is obviously about an ice wing which I thought was really interesting because we hadn't had a book from the point of view of an ice wing before. So it was a lot different than the previous books because we hadn't really seen too much of an ice wing in really any of these stories. We got like a glimpse of Queen Glacier in The Brightest Night and there was a few mentions here and there, but not really getting into their traditions or their... Um, views on the world and they're kind of like mil they're kind of like the Spartans of the dragon world really because that's what they do they train for war and everything is about being the strongest the boldest the bravest I mean it's and it's a very harsh environment for them to live in and it's also kind of turned them kind of harsh and the main character he kind of doesn't fit in so it's a great book for children I think and I think that this one is a lot more intense than some of the other ones because he's breaking a lot of his family's traditions and we have this mystery ice wing who shows up in the middle of the book and he's only there for like a little bit but I'm wondering if he's gonna play a bigger role later on so there is a lot to say about this book. It was absolutely fabulous. Five out of five stars. So like, comment, subscribe. If you have read this, let me know. If you have read all the other books and you haven't read this, you need to pick it up. And um, I really want your opinions on the series so far. And if you have decided to not continue on with the stories, why would series? Why would that be? And things like that. So. Anyway, I hope to see you soon.